Hey y'all, this is Pax. I'm in uh, Ludington, Michigan right now, and I'm actually sitting in my truck waiting on Meredith to come down from the hotel room. We're staying at the Holiday Inn Express. We are here to mark Christmas trees this this time of year. We come up, I've uh, been doing it for since 2011, I think. We've been coming up every year, um, marking Christmas trees, getting them selected and ready for shipment they uh they won't cut them until close to thanksgiving and then they'll bundle them up ship them in a big truck down to kentucky and we uh set up our christmas tree lot down there anyway when we're uh up here marking christmas trees we stay in a hotel and then we go out every day and we uh, band or tag trees different colors for different grades and different heights and we measure every tree and I'll try and share some of that with you here over the next few days but anyway I just wanted to um, kind of kick off my channel a little bit by saying that uh, my videos will be varied and different um, there'll be some things that are your you'll probably be like well it's just like everybody else's stuff but I wanna, I wanna share with you a lot of just um, little things, life skills. I'll try and intertwine uh, why I do what I do, the way I do it. Um, not that it's right or wrong. Um, I'm sure that there's always people who do things a lot better than we do. But I have found that in this life, uh, there are less and less people that know how to do anything. And uh, it just blows my mind and uh, I've had a whole bunch of people in the last oh probably six seven years that have asked me to start sharing things um, on YouTube and I keep teasing about it I keep saying well I should do that I should start a channel um, I don't think I'm gonna become super famous but uh, it would be a whole lot of fun to have the interaction with people that are uh, super interested in learning how to do things and when I say things I mean everything from construction to farming to homesteading to prepping uh, I have a construction company and a roll-off dumpster company and then we have a farm and we kind of homestead and uh, I have become a prepper of sorts I don't uh, don't claim to be any kind of professional at that but I like to be prepared for things and uh, so whether it's in my company or my business or in my travels where I'm traveling and going somewhere and doing something uh, in my spiritual life, uh, my family, um, I've made enough mistakes in my life to know that I need to, to prepare. And so hopefully the uh, mature 40-something me is more prepared than I was 20-something years ago uh, for life. But anyway, there is, uh, there is very little time uh, in our lives to make mistakes and as my dad used to say we don't have time for a shortcut and so um, it's not worth taking a shortcut it's worth investing yourself in everything that you do and uh, striving for perfection um, that was something my mother used to say all the time strive for perfection if we are striving for perfection uh, we're less likely to miss the mark. We're still going to miss it a little bit. We're never going to get it perfect. But if we don't try, if we don't try to do things the right way the first time with intent and with carefulness, uh, we'll miss the mark all the time. We won't ever, we won't ever make it right. And so whether it's your personal life whether it's the job you're doing for somebody else, whether it's the business you run for yourself, maybe it's the relationships that you have with your children or your wife or your husband or whoever it is, strive for perfection. Try to, try to get it right the first time because you don't have time for shortcuts and you don't have time for redos and being prepared ahead of time will make all of those relationships and those events a whole lot less uh, of a struggle and make things easier. Anyway, I don't mean to get all gloomy about it. I just want to share with you where I'm going with my particular channel. I have, um, I have been in construction since I was an apprentice for uh, 
long time, over 30 years already, and uh, since I was a kid. And now I'm in my mid 40s, and um, we have we have had our ups and downs in business. We went through the last recession in business, and we uh, saw that coming, and we struggled, and we adjusted, and we pivoted, as you might say, and we came out of it really strong on the other side. And um, I think there's a lot of stuff coming up very quickly in our society and in our uh, with our monetary system and all of those things, which I'm no expert, I can't speak to that. Um, but there's my feeling is that there's a lot of stuff going on, and those things that go on uh, eventually will affect you, affect me, affect our families, affect everyone. And so, being prepared for daily life um, and being prepared and strengthening your relationships and all those kinds of things is going to be really important moving forward in the in the near term so anyway let's uh let's get prepared together and do what we can do um in every way uh to be able to help our families and our children our spouses our loved ones and and do uh do the hard work of redeeming the time and bringing glory to God. Anyway, with that, uh, please press the like button. I know this wasn't much of a video, just an introduction, but uh, we're going to get to work. I've got several things I'm going to share with you, and if you'll push that like button, maybe we can get this channel started together. Y'all take care.